Hello and welcome to a little bit of a unusual slash random video. In this video we are playing on a server called Outer Realms and the owner of this server actually reached out to me and asked if I wanted to check it out and I agreed to it and so here I am checking it out. This is a survival slash RPG server. Uh, links to the server and the IP and stuff will be down in the description. I actually don't think it has a website, I'm not sure about that. If it is, it'll be down in the description together with the IP. Go ahead and check it out. You can join between versions 1.4.2 all the way up to 1.16.1. Now, I did get told that the server is currently getting a little bit of a revamp, but it does not hinder you in playing on it whatsoever. Um, though you do have to manually install the resource pack, um, just click on the button and download it right there. Also, the server works best in 1.12. Point two with the specific resource pack. So here we are. I just joined the server right here. This is where I spawned. And I must say, these are some pretty cool effects. I like it. Um, all right, so we have some items in our hotbar here. We have Slime Fun Guide. I've played with this plugin before. It is basically like a replacement for industry mods. It has multi-block machines and all sorts of stuff. Uh, for example, ore crushers and compressors and what you would usually see in your typical industry mods. It even has power and stuff, so that's pretty cool. We also have a diamond sword. Interesting. We have bread. We have the ultimate guide and we have how to claim land. We also have a sign here that says sprint and double tap jump to perform an air dash. And I don't know about you, but my legs are tired from sitting. I want to move. So uh, sprint and double tap jump to perform an air dash. So, huh? Okay. Walk and double tap jump to perform a high jump. Nice. Talk to NPCs by right clicking on them. Uh... I assume that's a glitch. <laughs> Humans never learn, do you? You cannot have my power. Many have tried and all have failed. Oh dear, what's going on? What makes you think you're any different? Fine then, try if you want. You can learn the hard way. You've much to overcome. Good luck, human. Ooh, that's music. Oh, what's going on? Choose a class. You can switch classes at any time you want. All right. We have Reaper, powerful fighter with high defense, can summon undead soldiers in battle. Mage has high range, damage, and AOE abilities at the cost of defense. Rogue, fast and deadly, string combos together for extreme damage. Priest, essential healing and supporting abilities yourself and others. If you want to skip the intro, no, I don't want to skip any intro. I want to take rogue, I think. You are now a rogue. All right, so my mana looks like it's increasing. Tutorial on day. What? Every class has four spells they can cast. You need to be holding a diamond weapon in your hand to cast spells. All right. Your first spell, running slash, can be cast using right, right. So right click plus right. Objective: defeat undead. All right. So I press right click two times, and it did that. Nice. Mainly attack enemies to gain mana faster. Alright. But that's just like normal. Hold on. Mainly attack enemies to gain mana faster. Your second spell, Extended Slash, can now be cast using right plus shift. Ooh. And then I can combo like that. Nice. I like it. Your third spell, Air Slash, can be casted using Shift plus Right. Maybe I'm not supposed to do anything. Oh, cool. Nice. Gotta eat some bread here. Gotta get the health up. Your ultimate spell, Dimension Slash, can be cast by tapping Shift plus Shift. Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna do that again. Nice! That's cool. Level up, now level 2. Rage damage. One time, 1.2 times, not bad. You receive 25 bonus money, you gain 25 bonus experience, you leveled up. Type Clash ATTR to use your skill points. Class ATTR. Attributes. 
Strength grants 3% increased non-skill damage per point invested. Vitality grants 1 health per point invested. Grants 1 mana and 2.5% mana regeneration per point invested. Skill grants 3.5% increased skill damage per point invested. I like the sound of health, but... I'm just gonna do skill, I think. Boom. Take a leap. You won't take any fall damage. Whoa, look at this map. Ow! I that that Ow. <laughs> take a leap, you won't take any fall damage. Get on a bow! I better not. Nice. Look at that. Looks awesome. Oh no. Uh wait. I don't know. Do I trust this? Hold on here. Wait, do I have also jump on? I do. Hold on. Uh, yeah, get off. I don't like it. If you don't care for dialogue or story, type spawn to run into the world. No, I don't. I want to get the dialogue. Whoa. Do I run across this? I mean, I don't have a choice, do I? Oh, wait. Haha. <laughs> Double jumping has a two second cooldown. Ooh. Wait, am I on a spaceship? Some NPCs will have quests when you talk to them. Recruit, recruit. We have Wanda here. Hold up. Wow, we are on a ship. What's back here? Cyborg pilot. <laughs> Hello. Bedroom part. Nice. Alright, let's talk to the captain, I guess. Well, well, well. Hello there. Looks like we have another cadet who has woken up from their cold nap. I'm Captain Argon. I'm one of the three commanders who run this ship. You came at a very convenient time. Confused what to do? Slash warp tutorial for help. You look very confused, my friend. If you have any questions, ask away. Don't be shy. The captain seems like a very cheerful individual. This doesn't really seem like the personality of someone who would be in charge. I need to ask him some questions. All right, I'm gonna keep asking. Ask me anything. Select an option by opening chat T and select one of the options by clicking the symbol. Where are we? What do you mean by cadet? Where should I go? Before you were put in stasis, you were enlisted into the Outer Realms Legion. I'm sure you have no memory of what you're doing here, but keep this in mind. All you need to know right now is that you serve us, the Legion. Remember our oath, if nothing else. And don't think about doing anything foolish. Or else. The captain is giving off an intimidating aura all of a sudden. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, where are we? You are in a ship owned by the Outer Realms Legion, a group created to discover new worlds. We're currently traveling through the void. We're coming close to a new world and we are going to send you there to gather resources. Where should I go? It's going to be a while until we near the next world. We'll be sending you to world Zeno. Feel free to talk uh, with the other captain and recruits here. If you want to enter the world, sleep in the bedroom part behind you. All right. Some NPCs will have quests for you. I want to talk to some of these recruits here. Hold on. Hey there. Uh, hey. Uh, okay. Recruit, well, what the hell I forgot what this button does. Uh, I told you, don't press that, you don't. Focus, newbie. Or do you want to get sent down with the rest of the cadets? No, 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 please, anything but that. The ones are so scary. Hmm. Looks interesting. Hmm. Still same reaction, huh? All right, maybe this one is a little bit... Okay, this one looks like they know what they're doing. Yep, they, they do. Wanda, we are nearing the next world. We'll be there shortly. Prepare for release of more cadets. We'll need everyone we can get for this world. All right. Cool. What about the cyborg? But I'm, just, I'm gonna talk to this guy. He looks cool. Give me that armor, buddy. Where we land, you will find yourself in the cathedral. Am I just not able to speak English? Those who landed a few days before us spilled it all. It's basically the Legion's safe base. Run out into the world, however, and anything is fair game. Remember that you can outrun most enemies with your double jump. Cyborg pilot. 
Get it? That's probably something you should know before you sleep. The world we are near causes people to have some very weird and sometimes dangerous dreams. Some gain strange powers and others have died. Be careful. Oh dear. <laughs> By sleeping in a bit you can access the dream world which will move the main story forward and regain your memories. The decisions you make in the dream world will drastically affect the story and some gameplay elements later on. Now, this seems very interesting. Leave a like and a comment if you wish to see more of this. Alright, some NPCs will have quests when you talk to them. Quest. Hello there. Mm, hello there, my little delight here. I could have spilled an exquisite proposition for you. As you must know already, dear, I am the great, amazing, noble, merciless, generous, and powerful, handsome, teaching, compassionate, popular, admirable, gracious, intelligent, sensible, sincere. This quite witty man that stands before you is none other than Lord Gazel. The noblest of nobles in all the realms. And you, my good fellow, are invited to join me in a scrumptious feast of my mansion. At my mansion. I will see you later. Ta-ta for now. Oh dear. Well, Orgazo is so cool and high class. I'm so honored he took a minute out of his day to invite me to his feast. Hold on. He didn't say where the mansion was. Hmm. Hmm, you're back. Okay, so... How delightful, you have come to talk to the... No, no, mm -mm. I'm not saying all those again. It was hard enough to keep up the first time. No, no, yeah, I know who you are. Uh, can you just do this? Yeah, he, he literally just did this. What? You don't know where my mansion is? What heresy? No matter. My great amusing mansion resides in the poisonous swamp on World Zeno. Now move along. Ah, okay. Well, I guess we shall um, sleep in bed and uh, potentially die from weird dreams. Did we talk to everyone here? I think we talked to everyone here. All right, let's uh, let's sleep then. Oh. So is this the dream world? It is highly recommended that you read the tutorials in the houses. You can jump straight into the world by typing warp warp wild. Good luck. All right, so. Classes and skills info. So this is all the tutorial section. Main world portal, maps and map info, jobs tutorial, special items and enchants info. Alright, let me read some of these. So slime fun tutorials. Um, slime fun, as I already said, is like an industry mod uh, plugin. It's a plugin. Link if you would like to know more about the items. I've already played with this and it's actually pretty cool. Definitely recommend checking it out if you're into... Um, Industrial mods, classes and skills info. Detailed in-depth tutorial that goes into very small detail. Every small detail. <laughs> Not for noobs. This exists for people who want to calculate how much damage they deal or plan out a build. Uh, under simulation. So this is basically like kind of a... Like a training, I suppose. Yeah, like a training basically. Alright, so there's definitely a lot to check out here in this, I guess, lobby area. It's lo it looks very, very cool and I definitely recommend checking out every single thing here in all the houses and such to get all the info. I'm going to uh, not include that in the, in the video as such uh, because too many details and stuff like that can just make it boring. So I recommend you guys check it out for those of you who want all that uh, cool information, just like skills and classes, like it said. Uh, calculations and whatnot. Special items and enchantments information. Shop and plot purchasing info. Credits and people. Let's go in there for a second. Hold on. Jobs tutorial. So you can, I will assume you can always return here whenever you want to get information about one of these things. Credits and people. Staff team. Let's just get a good view of that. Not every build was built here. The folks at Planet Minecraft helped a bunch. Nice. So that's all that. If you are interested in any of that as well. I'm gonna try and head into the main world here and uh, see what happens. I guess this, from my understanding, this should continue the storyline. There's also the ultimate guide right here. And there's a bunch of useful information as well, such as commands, jobs, and other stuff like that as well so i definitely recommend checking that out as well and as well also how to claim land let's step through the main world portal okay what do we got here cathedral constructed by whoa that's a huge that's that do be huge legion builder 
Oh, so we're in like the safe spot right now, uh, the Legion build thing. Welcome to the Divine Dragon's Cathedral. I am one of the builders of this place. Very nice to meet you, Banner Vigilante. I hope you use this cathedral to serve the Legion well. Nice. Quest rewards. Ah, cool, cool, cool. Jail. Ah, I assume that's where you end up if you are being a bad boy. Hello. The quest traders reward cadets for helping out other people in the world. Well, Xeno is a very dangerous place and many are not able to complete their jobs on their own. That's where you cadets come in. You are imbued with powers that other members do not have. Send mobs with a star in their name will give side quests. Complete them to gain special weapons and tools. Nice. What's through here, I wonder? Nice, so this looks like it is the main, like the world you can actually step into. That's pretty cool. What do we got here? News and updates board. GJ floor requires resource pack. Wait, 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 wait. All right, so that's interesting. The GJ floor has a bunch of music to play. These right here, potion traders, key hunter, hello there. Monster's essence is dropped by powerful monsters you may incur in the world. The farther you go out from spawn, the stronger the monsters become. Okay. That's good to know. Prices and crates, you can also go ahead and vote for the server as well. And I guess that's how you get crates as well. Potion and trades. Hold up. Am I? I don't think I can. Can I take? I'm just going to leave that. <laughs> Potion merchant. That's pretty cool. A bunch of different ones as well. Two healing potions in one. Grants resistance. Grants haste. Editor recommended when used. Mob collection. Mob arena challenges. The end trial, nether portal, dueling arenas and events, practice tool, and who are you? Shopkeeper. All of this seems very cool. Who are you? More traders as well. And I guess that just opens up to the world as well. Yeah, I thought so. I don't know where uh, the, the, the weird wizard dude's mansion is. Base supplier. Four beings who were given great powers are hidden beneath the depth of this world. It is said that he who defeats these beings are given the right to the end trial. What is the end trial? Nobody from the Legion knows. It's a mystery. Interesting. Another portal. Mob arena challenges. Mob collection. What's through here then? Mob collection. Buy friendly eggs of monsters to help you fight. Important. Don't use these eggs in places you can't build. Okay, ah, and I can, I think I can buy them. There is a lot. Oh my. Mob Arena challenges. Join Mob Arena, level 40 plus. I think I'm what, level two or something? Yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna survive one moment in here. <laughs> training area, right click a training skeleton and practice. Hello. Do nothing, ah, that's very cool. Heal yourself, attack with bow, attack with sword. Under simulation. Oh, that's cool. Very cool, actually. All right, this is interesting. There is a path here leading over to this ruin thing. So maybe the story continues if you follow this road. We're now leaving spawn protection and can build. Also, there are mobs in the world. Uh, yeah, yeah. Sealed blue clay. Give. Ah, spider cave. Building restricted. Okay. Ooh, look at the inventory. Change the plate. I'll take it. I need I need protection. Spider gem. Inside your own risk. And then there's mobs. All right. I very... That, this is very, very cool. Wait, what do we have here? Ah. Ow. Ah, go away. Go away. What's this? Rock. That's it. Okay. Well, then. This episode... What on earth? Hey guys. Traveling villagers. Ah, and then they have trades. That's cool. Alright guys, I think I am going to call it a video here. It is probably around 25 minutes long. And I really hope you have enjoyed. Uh, definitely check out the server. I think it's looking really cool. And it is very well made with all like the music and the effects. And also the storyline and such. I think it's very cool and definitely deserves a look. All the information will be down in the description down below. Do indeed check it out. And if you want to see more of this, be sure to leave a like and subscribe as well if you haven't already. And leave a comment 
saying you want more. But anyways, that's gonna be it for this one. Hope you enjoy it and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day and goodbye. Hold on, I, I gotta kill something. Gotta kill something. Boom. I gained five experience. This is cool though. <laughs> this is very cool. Wait, what's that? Ah! That's mobs. That's dangerous mobs. Mobs are dangerous. Cake enthusiast. I think that's an NPC I can do quests for. If we do an episode 2, we will uh, have to try and find the the mansion of weird wizard dude. Uh, yeah, we'll have to do that. But anyways, I've got to go. Hope you enjoyed. Have a wonderful day before I die. Uh, goodbye. <laughs> And now level three, noise. Okay. Yeah. Ow.